once you get down here. Show me that fancy gun up close. Not a lot of people can get past my orders. I'll give you that! I'm fine, Preston. Quit fussing. Da. 
That was a pretty big mistake. I'm just glad you were on our side. You guys gonna be okay now? Yeah. For a while, anyway. We can at least move someplace. Listen. When we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. What happens now? For the longest time, Mama Murphy's had a vision of a place called Sanctuary. Some old neighborhood, but one we can make new again. Why don't you come with us? I could really use your help. What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Cause there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Okay. I'm listening. You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel... Your son's energy. He's alive. Bullshit. You're trying to play me for a fool. Oh, no, kid. No. The sight's sometimes foggy, but it ain't ever a liar. Your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here? He's gonna need it, too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're head... <coughs> she knows about it? to keep moving. You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Mert? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, out hold on. Than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June, it's time to go. Oh, okay. Get the price we paid to get this far. Let's move out. I'll take point. Stick close, everyone. We're right behind you, boss. Don't worry. I'll get these people to sanctuary.
Sir, I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Concord. How were things here while I was gone? Oh, just catching up on old yard work. Some occasional pest control. And you, sir? Anything to be found in Concord? You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed, I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Would you like to? As you wish, sir. No, not now. All right, then. you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? So, do you believe in these visions she has? I didn't used to, but how did she know about this place? I think she has some kind of a gift. Best not to ignore it. I mean, look at this place. I really think this could be what we've been looking for. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? What kind of help do they need? Sounded like the usual, raiders. You'll have to get all the details when you talk to them. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get.
caps to be made for technical. Excuse me. Don't eye the Brahmin if you got any sense. The only way you get old in this job is assume everyone's out to kill you. Stick to the roads, and you got a better chance of surviving. Hi. Got the best armor in these parts. What kind of stuff do you have? I sell armor for Old Man Stockton's outfit, based out of Bunker Hill. Been selling armor to smart wastelanders for years. The dumb ones walk away empty-handed. But they don't stay dumb long, if you catch my meaning. I'll take a look. Sure. My prices are firm. Haggling gives me a headache. Make a move and I'll end you. Wastelander. Too many miles on the road. At least the pay is terrible. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders. But honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. After Quincy. Bad business, that. Is there something you need my help with? Oh, yeah. I'm damn glad you're here. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. I'll kick their asses for you. No problem. Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real this time, there'll be a welcome change for the better. Hey there. The farm's not much. But it's something. 